And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And on the menu for you is live action from the Cinch Premiership. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And so the battle commences. <laughs> Moving forward effectively. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. But this could pose problems for the defenders. for starters first goal of the game well here's the replay and confirmation that he did get a touch on the ball unfortunately it wasn't enough to prevent the goal So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Ginelli. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Crossing opportunity. And the body in the way. A decisive clearance it was. JKK, please contact the nearest security guard. Thank you. Harmon. And Danda now. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Civic. Haring. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Can they create something from here? The cross is on. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity.
Haring. Mackay. Josh Janelli. And unable to keep possession. Chance to do damage. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. So a deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. They favoured a short one here. A wonderful intervention. Josh Ginelli. Brophy. He continues his run. The first half here comes to an end. Well, an honest assessment, Stuart, would be that he hasn't really been on top of his game at attack. Yeah, I've been really disappointed with him today, Derek. He just hasn't looked himself. But I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service, has he? And this confrontation is underway. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. And taking it away. Jan Danda. Brophy. How about the cross? Doing well to keep possession. Very quick thinking there. Devlin. Smith. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. And they need to get tighter here. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well cleared away. Has a go. Determined block. No strong hand on the ball. Brophy. Randall. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Well, the hosts have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes, and they've created chances. It just now needs one of those chances to be taken, but you feel it's coming. Yes, it's going to plan, and they might be able to carve out another chance. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. I just couldn't play that decisive ball. Harmon. Jan Danda. Good movement. Could be dangerous. Options in the middle. Can he finish them off? 
Oh, a fine save at this point in the game. Well, he's just about kept them in it, but time's against them here. And the substitution will occur now. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Still not clear. It might be. Well, I think it's fair to say he got underneath that just a little bit. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Mackay. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.